The cradle! It's been activated? Excellent. Oh, that's so mean. Oh, this is pretty cool. <laughs> this is like a completely different style. <laughs> hmm. You mean the art style? Or the uh, yeah. geometry, the architecture uh, in the mostly, game? Mostly, mostly the art style. <laughs> ah. Who was that guy you forgot to mention in the last one? Neo uh, Cortex something something? I don't think it really matters. In the last video, there was just some talk about how... Consciousness. Never mind, it doesn't matter anymore. I was gonna do a name drop of Christoph Koch for Neural Correlates of Consciousness. Ah. But it doesn't really make sense anymore, so we can forget about that. I like indoor trains. Hey, look, it's like a train. These guys have indoor trains, that's so cool. I had a cool I idea, like a long time ago, for indoor windows. I came up with that idea when I was playing Sims for the first time. Wait, what? Like indoor windows so that, you know, if you're you're in your bedroom, you open up a window. Like you have windows on all walls, no matter where they go. So you open up a window in your bedroom and it leads into the kitchen or something. Or you open up a window in your kitchen and it points into the bathroom. <laughs> Wait, what? How, are you, like... Are I mean, there are blinds. There are blinds. Or shutters. Okay, so it's not like it's just. It's not glass. just open glass or anything. <laughs> okay, because I was imagining open glass, and you're like, you open the window, and it leads into the kitchen. It's <laughs> like, well, your window's a window. No, I mean you can look through the window, from one room to the next to the next. Oh, some people have those, but they're usually just you know glass or something. Hmm. It's not actually like a window that you would open. Why uh, is some nobody do have turning well, nobody's have taking me up on this idea? Turnings. I don't see the point. What's the point? Coolness? Uh, okay, we found the Dragon Mare production place. My Where? grandma has sort of a indoor window. She has her bathroom is It's got more of a steampunk feel. I'm explaining oh, my grandma's bathroom. Yeah. Why aren't you listening? Because we're aborting all these dragon mares, third term. Oh. I'm trying not to think about this because this is making me cry. Oh, because of all their... Yeah, like, it's, it's seriously going to make me cry. Cries. So I'm going to talk about my grandma's bathroom instead. Her bathroom is right beside this uh, corridor that's completely indoors, but the uh, corridor leads out into the patio, so it's kind of like outside but inside still and she has a bathroom window that opens up to that corridor so it's like an indoor window any second and now that's my story <laughs> any second well we're about to get the final upgrade for the heavy it's going to be level five which is the highest any levels can get If I can just He's finish off those last... <laughs> God, give... No! Uh, seriously? Uh, seriously? Almost. Almost. Uh, uh, that is so disappointing. I'm debating whether or not to increase other things. Because I put an extra couple energy orbs into the glide wing. I could have leveled up the heavy there, but I decided not to. Yeah. Completely intentionally. This is extremely sad for me. Why? Because we just blew past all those suicide bombers, or you mean we aborted all those dragon mares? Uh, yeah, all the dead dragon mares and suicide bombers. I hate suicide bombers. I said that already, but I hate suicide bombers. I mean, if you have a suicide bomber problem, doesn't it kind of take care of itself? Oh yeah. yeah, level five heavy. Yay! Its wings are all skeletal. <laughs> I know. It's pretty badass. 
And now that we have the level 5 heavy, we're going to be able to take out that bad boy. He should look familiar. <laughs> oh my god, tripping out. <laughs> well, the Empire caught some of the ancient weaponry and they're all testing it out in here. Yeah. Trying to figure out how it works and reverse engineer it, but they still can't really figure out how much of it works. It's because they're so close-minded. But they've got their airships going, they've got these huge battalions, and they don't really know how to make dragon mares, so they get drones to do that for them. Which sort of explains why they were after Orta in the beginning. Because yeah. that was just a mystery to us before, and now we realize that Orta's half drone, so they would be able to use her to make new dragon mares. Oh, this is definitely making me cry. We could have left that thing alone, but if you kill it, you get magical level up energy orbs, so I just felt like being cruel and killing it. You're so mean. I hate you. I hope they do kill you now. <laughs> that one is kind of a sad scene, because it's just tied up. It can't even fight back. I know, you're such a jerk. But the game encourages it. it you get stronger by doing better. it. You know, if somebody told you to jump off a bridge, would you go do it? Well, the game encourages killing, so obviously I'm supposed to kill as many things as possible. Uh, you're just gonna turn into a suicide bomber. Hmm. No, nah, there's no money in earlier. it. <laughs> I was gonna say earlier that it's very uh, interesting to see the heavy with the skeletal wings. Um, How it actually flies. To fly. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Maybe there's something so solid cool. there, it's just transparent. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. It just... It does look really pretty, though. Oh, what's going on here? This... Oh. Oh what? What are, what are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> You've done it again. You've done it again. <laughs> Fix that. <laughs> Fix that. <laughs> You're making an announcement. What are you doing? What is this? What is going on? What is this? I don't even... What is this place? Oh dear. Okay, uh, I don't get how we're flying so slowly. No, what, I think you've sort of like reached a weird limit or something. Just a... God damn it, Grids. <laughs> okay, we're uh, never letting Sir Omni host a call again. I know we said that last you time, just but... Why do you stop mentioning that there's a break in it? You just draw more attention to it, and nobody likes that. It's gonna be such so an obvious So now we're shooting break. things, and there's more trippy stuff going on, and we're all on acid. This is great. I wish I I'm were little, on acid right now. <laughs> yeah. I'm a little confused about what's going on. What are all these? Oh, They're just all the, trying to kill you still? It's the airship production place, and this is supposed to be one of their greatest airships, which is identical to their very first airship. Oh, right. <laughs> I remember all the way back then. Mm-hmm. A lifetime it's just, ago. It's not even flying, it's just stationary here, because I guess they're still in the process of building it. Well. Oh. I don't know why this one's so cool. We're about to see a much, much cooler airship later on. Ah, oh, spoilers! What is this? Ugh, I'm not spoiling anything. I'm yeah, spoiling just that I could spoil things. Clearly, you should stop talking about the game. Uh, <laughs> I can't talk about the game without talking about what's coming up next. <laughs> spoilers! Annika is really Bruce Willis, and Bruce Willis is really dead. Oh, stop doing that! I'm gonna punch you. All right. Notice our berserk bar um, down there at the bottom left, that big blue diagonal thing? That's gotten thicker and thicker as we've leveled it up. Now that we're the level 5, it's just a huge thing. It sort of determines the power and how long it lasts. That's what he said. Uh, you say that's what he said? <laughs> yeah, I did. That's what Sir Omni said. Yeah, that's exactly what he said. Last night. With your mom. Alright. Well, something is breaking out of here. 
Ooh. I'm not sure if it's us or what. Uh, who designs their enormous how, aircraft carrier who the, in this way? How the hell are we supposed to know where we're going? <laughs> it's just... I guess the dragon has senses of where the exit is. Right. And where walls are closing in. This is getting really Star Foxy. Cause I sure as hell have no idea what's going on. Ah, that's a wall. There's another <laughs> wall. That thing is solid. Oh my god. And I am also solid. Use the boost to get through. <laughs> if I move forward, I will just collide with it. Oh, funky music. See, I didn't spoil anything. It's just... It was coming two minutes later. Oh. How did they figure out how to make dragons? Um, I don't know, but... This is also kind of like Star Fox. Oh yeah, this guy with the floaty hands. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Alright. His hands are supposed to be pretty dangerous things, but we can just destroy them. Does this them. thing have like a loincloth? Oh uh, yeah, it's got some dangly <laughs> little legs there too. <laughs> pay some attention right. to the way those legs are moving around like a little kid in a just, like, the floaty around. raft in the pool. Yeah. yeah. There is a purpose for them. They'll, uh... Kick you in the face? They'll kick me with electricity if I don't move. You won't be able to dodge this. Oh, really? Um, here's me dodging oh, it. Oh, shit! That just happened. It did. You can blow the legs up and it can't do that. I like how you can, uh... Cripple off just different little portions of it, like at a time. You break the yeah. legs, then it can't do the leg things anymore. If you break the arms, then it can't do much arm stuff. So you can that actually focus on different sense. things. And I like that it's <laughs> not just general damage that you do. Yeah. It's actually yeah. locational damage. That is pretty cool. What is big glowy arm balls? No, I mean what damage. you're talking about. <laughs> Localized damage. Hmm. And it's gonna break oh. again if I have anything to say about it. Do you? Do yep. you? Eh, missiles. It's not even interesting uh, anymore. We've seen things. it. Seen it. Phallic objects. At this point there's nothing really to comment on. Well, there's also com to comment on, like, all this shit. Hmm. There's some fights that I don't like, because it makes sense for your dragon to be facing a certain direction when you're flying. But here he's stationary. We have no reason to be shooting a thing behind us. <laughs> We're just, like, treading water but in the air, you know what I mean? We're just hovering. So why doesn't the dragon just pull a 180 and face it? Uh, I guess it's just uh, equally deadly from all directions, so it doesn't matter. Yeah. Wait, now it's going. Oh, battle, battle mode. mode. <laughs> hang on, guys. Hang on. We'll just we'll just hang on and wait for a bit. I figure this thing would be in battle mode at all times. I think that's the point we're just making. It's what a war machine does. Considering they're fighting the. Only, like, the one person who's completely destroyed their, like, armada. <laughs> this is a fun attack. Yay! Keep in mind what it's doing here, because it's going to attempt something a little later. Spoilers! No! <laughs> oh, oh, now the plot of the game is ruined! <laughs> There really isn't uh, much left to spoil at this point. Ah, shush, you're spoiling about spoilers now! Ah. Oh my god! Ah. You're meta-spoiling! Oh my god! I wondered if that counts. Like, I'll spoil that a certain thing doesn't happen or something doesn't get explained, but it, is that I'm still spoiling? I'm definitely gonna say that it counts. Of course I'm gonna say that it counts. Ah. This, is a, this is a little uncomfortable. It's shooting balls now at you. Hmm. 